Let's look back at the highlights then at heat two of the Jerry Marshall Trophy with uh, a good start by Jake Hill in the Capri, catapulting him into the lead as they made that run down towards Magic for the first time. Nick Padmore's BMW slotting into second place. Steve Soper was third from Mike Whitaker, And then Stig Blomqvist, who as the race wore on, started to fall down through the pack. Carl's making their way out of Madrid for the first time. But it wasn't long before Jake Hill managed to build a lead. The problem was that Jack Techley was on a mission, carving his way through the pack, made short work of Nick Padmore's BMW and then inexorably closed on the race leading Capri. Sean Hollenby got into the back of the uh, Ludovic Lindsay. Capri coming down to Woodcut. Charles Brown nipping through the gap offered to him by the two cars sorting themselves out. Jake Hill for the race lead being reeled in by Jack Tetley. The three metre Capri looking underpowered against the Gruntingo Chevrolet. The gap coming down and down and down. The Camaro eventually making its way to the outside line coming through Ford Water and Jack Tetley going through. Jake Hill sitting on the back of him and at every opportunity he pushed again. Desperately trying to open that door, desperately trying to squeeze through. Steve Soper running wide, coming down through Woodcut and running out of road and that cost him a few places. He fell down the pack. So Steve Soper losing out, that put him down to uh, sixth place, which is where he finished in the end as uh, the race leaders battled their way up towards the timing line once more with Jake Hill trying to get the run but just as he was almost level so the power of the Chevrolet kicked in and that pulled Jack Tetley clear, he had this big big slide coming onto the back straight out of Magic on the run to Ford Water but again even that wasn't enough to help Jake because he just did not have the grunt to stay alongside Stuart Graham Chevrolet Camaro another one late race getting on with the programme because it came up to challenge first Steve Soper then Mike Whitaker got past both of the Capris and then the next target was Nick Padmore's BMW and he was able to get past him before the chequered flag flew. Craig Davis was set for third, Jake Hill would ultimately finish in second place and it was a race win for Jack Tetley. The winning margin 1.7 seconds at the end of a very frantic second heat in the Jerry Marshall Trophy.